Welcome back. This is um, part two of the um, reason about um, regarding Brother CMR and um, what he's dealing with at the hands of the um, social media experts. Yeah? So we'll just maybe um, recap a little bit um, into, in, a, in um, 30 seconds. <clears throat> all right so um you don't know this the the instagram thing i work with my thing already um them um then put a time up on my page where me and we can talk for a certain amount of time you see however you can join the the reasoning in um on youtube on subi the warrior you can subscribe to Subi the Warrior on um, YouTube. Where we're going with the reasoning because you know we have a reason, we have to talk, we have to make sense of um, have to try and make sense of the madness, and we have to put in our um, you know our two cents, I guess, upon the um, the social issues them, yeah. So we will continue to do that. Um, we will not. Excuse me. We will not get ahead of ourselves when it comes on to putting forward the information where can change lives. You see. So it's um Subi the warrior, Brenda, Brenda Lee. Subi, Subi the warrior upon YouTube. You see it right here. So be the warrior. Yeah. <clears throat> so, just to recap the reasoning um, about Brother CMR. So, we're talking in part one about um, you know the amount of people that we see are having a field day and the amount of um, hate and um, you know. In my view, um, hurtful words. I'm gonna call it that. In my view, hurtful words. Let me say them at the at the brother. Um, me think say it. Um, it's a little bit hypocritical. I think say some of y'all need to just chill out. Some of y'all need to just chill out. So that was what we were talking about in, in part one and we were drawing references from the the words of God, the Bible, where Jesus asked anyone without sin cast the first stone and nobody couldn't fling a stone. So we were kind of um, reasoning from that angle. Um, also to point out that um, African men are polygamous by nature and because men cannot be, cannot be honest about who they truly are, they, you know, they are labeled as whatever they are labeled as, as dogs and drunkards and all them things there, and serial cheaters and womanizers and all them things there. 
So if you um, did not watch part one, you have to watch part one before you get to part two. And this is actually the part two of that conversation. Okay? Now, back to the argument of um, polygamous relationships or polygamy. Right? Well, women, women they, 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 they um, you know, whenever men talk about um, polygamous relationships or polygamy, women, um, they reply with or, or they push back with um, they want to be, they want to um, also have multiple men as well. Well, no one is saying you can't have multiple men. Understand? If, you, if that's what you want to do. You know, if there's a purpose on your life and if, if there's a need that you have to, you know, fill, well, go ahead with your multiple men. However, nature strongly goes against that. You see? So, from a scientific um, approach or reasoning, um, you would have to figure out, you know, your fishy, the fishy scent of your vagina. Um, not saying that men, you know, based on the... the, the um, the world that we're living in or the world that they created not saying men cannot go out there and get something and mess you up as well because that is what they created they created something to go against the natural order of life or creation or reproduction so of course we understand that as well and that's why we encourage men to be careful and be honest honest with um, yourself and, 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 and whosoever you're in a relationship with case in point if you realize that um, you know you cannot have one woman. Be honest with the woman. She's going to, you know, some women are, are going to, are most women in the Western world, they're going to leave. Are they going to, quote unquote, fuck for you? Because they're going to because you come tell them, say, you want to be with somebody else that you're attracted to. Um, they must do the same thing. The difference is they're not going to tell you the truth. They're not going to give you a choice to say, um, oh, I want to do it as well. So you can decide if you can deal with it. Um, if you want to add to um, the pool um, that you know is being created in where she holds her seat, the semen when it is, is is released into her, you know that is that is something that women will not tell you. You know, you know, most women will not come to you and say, okay, that is what I want as well. You know, they will go behind your back and they will sleep with who they want to sleep with and tell them friends and so forth and so on. Now, what we have to understand is. As I was saying in part one, that this thing was created to suppress um, the black man's true feelings. Yeah, this thing that they created called um, monogamous or monogamy was created to um, suppress the black man's feeling, the African man feeling, because the African man is a provider by nature. The African man is a um, a protector by nature. The African man is a is a person. Or is, is a man who is supposed to um, oversee, you know, you know, you know what is happening with his tribe. You see, like how the lion oversee, protects, um, you know, care for his pride. You see, that is the nature of the African man. That means a lion does not get a lioness um, um, pregnant. And um, and walk away because another lioness is jealous. No, that lion will protect all those cubs, all the cubs with his life and the females. You see, so the African man was taken out of his his um, habitat and placed in a um, in a in a in a in a place or in a in a society um where he has to suppress his true you know lion characters or, or attributes right his lion's attributes so that is where we have a lot of issues with with with, with quote unquote men cheating in the western world and you know a lot of men get punished because um they quote unquote cheat or they commit infidelity or there's those type of things <clears throat> That's it what it, that is what it is. So until the, the, the black man can be honest, yeah, and maybe it will never happen because now women, you know, quote-unquote, have jealousy 
and women um, are independent and they have climbed the corporate ladder and all of these things and they don't need a man to be complete and all of these things that they you know they taught these these sisters um, or they can go find a white brother because the white men are more loving and more caring you see um, I don't think it is possible for men um, to be honest on this side of the, 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 um, the, 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 the world or globe or whatever you want to call it, the West. Because it's a system that is put in place and the system, you know, was, you know, you know, it's a system that was, well, that continued to build, continued to build the system from, for years, years, centuries. They build the system, this perfect family system. The perfect family, you know, they, and they show you pictures of what the perfect family looks like. You see? What they don't show you is um, what caused the imperfect family to look the way how it looks. That is what they don't teach us, you know. They don't teach us the truth. They don't teach us the truth about why the imperfect, imperfect family is the way it is. They don't teach us that when you remove the man from any situation or any relationship there creates there becomes an imbalance and that is how um, a lot of men are driven from their families driven from their homes because they go get a baby outside with a woman you know and this thing that they created this manufactured thing that was created called jealousy where a lot of women develop that attribute or that uh, or, or that 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 emotion you know and they say oh you don't respect my feeling you don't decide you don't that and whatever um that thing though you know you know helps to drive the man away from the family drive the man out of the home and now the, the government can step in and be and play the role of the man or the woman is now single single lady and she continues to be a continues to be a um a single lady um for many years and what are single ladies single ladies are women that um either have no man or them have a man will come and go or them have many men that them keep changing or rotating and um, because things are not working out because they're trying to find the perfect man in a western society and in my view that is hard to find in the african community in our diaspora so what this does when this whole monogamous um jealousy and all of them things that, that was created and fear of you know disease and all of them things there which they created the disease and now telling you to be afraid of it right knowing what they were doing when they created these diseases right to control the population now what happens when the man is no longer in the home Or this man does not have a relationship, a built-in relationship. We not talk relationship where a man go at the gate to drop off money. We not talk a relationship where you depend on the phone and talk to your youth them on Instagram or talk to them on WhatsApp Live or on or on um on whatever the device, whatever the app they have now. Yeah. We are talking about the man is not in the homes. The men are driven out of the homes. Right? And the women, they become vulnerable. And the children, they become vulnerable. You see? The children become vulnerable. And of course, especially little boys, little boys, when um, daddy is not around to protect them, the predators see that daddy is not there. And when daddy is not there with the children around, because you know daddy, I go pick up on certain behavior when mommy, mommy may not pick up on. Or vice versa, you know, mommy may pick up on um, behaviors where daddy don't pick up on, but you know, somebody is there, you know, we catch it. So a lot of these um, fathers that are driven out of the homes, when they, when, they, when they drive them out of the homes and leave the children alone, what do you think happen? The children um, are preyed on, you see? The children are victimized. And this now destroys the children's lives forever so a lot of you out there running around and driving around the men out of the homes and ganging up on the internet to encourage driving men out of the homes because they quote unquote cheat just know that 
while you're driving the man off, just know say the predators them are lining up to take advantage of the children them. And I'm not saying men should abuse this whole thing of the fear of predators attacking your children, but it's a reality. You understand? I'm not saying we should use that still to be, you know, this, 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 to have multiple women or, or, or whatever it is. I'm not saying to use that because. You know, we don't want to, to, to act as if we're manipulating a situation. But it's a reality. It's a reality. The men are driven out of the homes because of a westernized doctrine or dogma that they indoctrinated us with. And the children suffer as a consequence. And if you're going to tell me that the black or the African diaspora or the African communities if you're going to tell me that they are much better or they are you know it's working with driving the men out of the homes then be my guest because the last time me check the last time me check Zane me not see that the last time me check I'm not, me can find out is about abuse um, a man fling an next picnic upon the baby mother and him gone to a next man fling an next picnic upon the baby mother and him gone to and that is it and the cycle continues yes what may I say and some women they do have a problem with a man walking away leaving children them too know that too some women will, 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 will be happy for a man walk away leaving children them and leave them to predators and even when the predators them take advantage of the children and them know this yeah, because men are protectors by nature's by nature. Then when the man walk away and the children them become victim victims, them not care. Them not care about that, them not take that into consideration. Them them don't have no problem with that. You see? They have no problem with you walking away, leave your children. And leave them at the mercy of stepdaddies and cousins and uncles and neighbors they have no problem with that they have no problem with your children suffering they want you to get up and walk with your picnic them turn you about them some they even some i know some some women them don't even want you to talk to your baby mother you have some women them don't even want you to call your child's name around them You have some woman, them who no mind, you turn your back on your picnic them and left them to the mercy of the wolves them. And the vampires them out there. Not a how the woman them programmed. Them not have nothing. Name feelings towards where you are got you. We know say so you have a youth out there. Them want you to hide all the pitney from them. And here with the wickedest thing. Them, you have to hide that child or those children from them other siblings. Remember, you don't have them already. Remember, I don't tell you, so you can't go against the order of nature. You can't go against the cycle of life. No matter how much doctrine or dogma them create, you cannot go against reproduction and the cycle of life. Man, I go always err. There is no way them are okay and control population to the point where men stop reproduce. The jellyfish them not the sea where them responsible for combing the sea. Them reproduce abundantly when there is a need to. Just by nature's call. You see? That is it. You see a real woman? A real woman look out for your other children them. Yeah. Because I saw the African woman's I saw the African woman's tear. The hybrid African where them have now the West, yeah. How them one they tell the turn your back when you pitney them. The hybridized African them in the West. 
Part the one them where them take and turn into something else. The one them where we have the straight hair and the brown skin. The white skin. The one them where we love come tell you about say, oh, you know, I'm gonna start dating a white man. Because them things are over on the other side is greener. You see? That is it. They don't care. They don't care if your child go to hospital. And they have no history of the father in the system. So they can't detect early signs of any form of sickness or genetic disorder with the child may have. You see? Understand that. Because of the programming. In my view, if a woman can deal with a man still in her children's life, and what I mean in her children's life, I mean, no, him no want no man raising pitney them, him no want no stepdaddy raising pitney them. Lady, if you want go on, go on and allow me pitney them. And that me I say, you know. I don't deal with that. Go a gate, they drop off, drop off child and drop off pitney and them something. No, 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 no. That, that, that are before, that are when we did uneducated. That are when we did oblivious to where really are going. That are when we never know, say, the world is such a wicked place. Where even the stepdaddy, where the woman pick up and molest the pitney them. That are when, that are before we really realize how the agenda is set. For turn we look up boys them. In a females. If we turn with little girls them in a 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 whatever they want to turn them into. Because everything is designed. This is a design to mash up the black the black population. You have to understand that. So me don't want me not go me not go drive my woman with my pitney them. Zin? I say. Go on, what, 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 what do we do next, man? No. If you feel like, say, yo, my life no suit you, sister, go on, but you will go on, I'll leave a pit in them. Me will find we and take care of them because the lion, I got to take care of them. The lion, I got to protect them. Me no know what happened to them when me asleep. Me can't sleep. You see, no found out there when I say, brother, see him or Chris, if he left him and go fuck pan, go, go fuck pan him, go find a man and fuck. With four little girls. With four little girls. If you go bring in, Mr. Mr. Um, what you call it now? Fix things. Mr. Fix things. She go bring in Mr. Fix things now when I the four little youth them life. And when him done fix she and she gonna work or she leave him now for babysit. Him start fix the girls them too. And them girls they traumatize and all manner of things reach them for the rest of them life. Because some people on the internet know them have the answers. And the answer is just go find a miss a fix it. CJ? So all the experts that we are talking you know, I know so it's a quick fix for we don't get more things to talk about. Because we don't want a quick, fi quick fix so we don't can find more things to talk about on the internet for, for, for um, you know, for have, you know, we don't chat them and we don't expert 
analysis on the on the on, on people um um life. But just know the, the the world that we're living in now. Just know the world that we are living in now, and it's time for men to be honest. And sisters, keep on fooling yourself. Some real brothers out there when Naga walk left them pitney. And them polygamous by nature. So me understand so you know, uh, the perfect life and all of them things here. Based on the European definition of the perfect life. But remember me tell you say we not go always have man we are cheat. We not go always have man we are anki panky round so anki panky round so and no respect na go dead there. Una say, una say disrespect and all them things there, man. I disrespect una and all them things there. If a man come to una and tell him the truth. Listen me. No for you know. Una run left una man. To una find out say have a one woman. One woman. And go there with a man with five girl. No for una run left una man. Good, good home. Good, good bed. Nice, nice life. Una have una comfortable. Nobody na look for nobody na bother una. Una sex when una feel like. We no, we no do when we no, we no just cook when we no feel like, and the man no have no problem to uno. You see? I wanna run left the man, I run the man, and go take up man with all five women. You see? Uno don't come, come tell the world when 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 go go take up all a man with five women, you know. And I get some, and I get, some, and I get some disease from some man out there to you know, cause some man out there wanna run left when a good man with straight. I don't go there with some man we 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 we, we, we mix up. I don't go there with some man we mix up. We want to have it both ways. You see? Now if I want to run, run left on a good good man and go do three some. Because I want to go there with man we both say, yo, you want to bring our next girl in the thing. Now if I want enough woman me know, we run left them man. Go man a cheat. In breed one woman, in breed one girl, and me so hurt. And you so hurt, and you go out there, go there with smuddy man. You go out there, go there with smuddy man. Because, sisters, there are hardly any single men out there. I know you find a single man in your forties. Right now, take time to know him. And you go find a single man in your forties right now. Take time to know him. Look upon him sideways. Better know that. In this world, I know, where the ratio are like 10 to 1, 10 women to 1 man, and you are take up a 40 or a, or a 50 year old man about, oh, I'm single. Take time to know him. No for no woman want to see him around her life too. No for no woman. Uno forget some see him around her life too. Because no for no some good man, you know. You know, so get a one girl pregnant and find a one, a little one, you know, yeah, him have a one, him, yeah. Get a one girl, him get her pregnant and him, you know, him love him youth and him say, John, what's star, you know, so me get trapped star, yo, me can't left me youth star. John, you know. And the fear of, you know the dog shit them we are go come round him youth and the wicked man them and the and the rape of them and the predator them out another world and him just a boy channel. So him rent all the place and him buy all the place and him put all him youth and him have all him youth there and him woman there and him have a Jim Screech. A Jim Screech and you go find out say my Jim Screech and I go you find one little receipt or something. 